Hey there, Lord Nelly here, and what I want to do in this video is go over what my 24,000 view YouTube video taught me about YouTube. Okay? If you stay to the end of this video, I will provide you with a very special offer. Now, there's a few things that go into your YouTube channel and YouTube videos. Okay? So you have your channel, which is your name, like your YouTube name. So your YouTube channel name, you know, that's nowadays your at name. And then you have your banner. So it could be an ad for your channel with uh, some um, links here that allows you to click. So you can have a website link, different ways to redirect traffic from your banner. Okay, so all very powerful, very usable stuff. You definitely want to Put this stuff in place for each youtube video you need the video itself the description the title of course which is very important and i'll go into that in a second of why that is so important and your thumbnail There's also tags, um, uh, captions or sub subtitles that tell you, um, like transcriptions, basically. Uh, get me an S here. Okay, thumbnail is also very important. I'll tell you why. So tags will tell YouTube what kind of uh, category your video falls into. Now, how? Closely, YouTube follows this is very debatable. And then subtitles probably helps with people watching your video, especially if they're in a setting where they can't play uh, audio. So maybe they're in bed with a spouse and they don't want to disrupt their spouse to sleep and they're watching a video. Or maybe they're uh, on a train or bus to work or something like that in a, a public commute and they don't want to disrupt the people around them. So they want to listen to the video on mute and still follow along with what you're saying and they might not have heads a headset or headphones to follow along so that could be very important i could do better at this for sure the title is of course enticing to the person it attracts them it tells them that they're in the right spot and it's the information they're looking for it could also help with search engine optimization especially if you're picking up traffic from google someone searches for it and you uh, rank in Google that'll definitely help your viewership increase The thumbnail though is what is the difference maker between whether someone clicks to view your video or no click And I'll tell you why if you're scrolling and you see a Title and you're like that sounds cool. Let's look at the thumbnail and eh, thumbnail looks like crap I also have to do better at this for sure, but if you have simple bright colors um, quick messaging with a quick headline, an image that entices the person to be um, curious, to want more from the video to see, that'll get your clicks up. And what where that is important is impressions. So how many people see your thumbnail versus how many people click to watch the video, okay? If your thumbnail, your video appears beside another video to recommend that viewer to watch your video next and you're getting a lot of clicks, then YouTube will reward that video and spread it out further in other suggested uh, views as the next uh, video to watch. And the reason that is very powerful is because YouTube wants you to stay on YouTube longer. So if they watch a video... If a user watches a video and they like it and then they see your video next in the suggested view and they, it's getting, getting a lot of clicks because the thumbnail is attractive, then YouTube will say, this is working. I'm going to continue showing this video to this audience to keep them on YouTube. And how you get rewarded is because then you get views on your video. Okay, so that thumbnail is important. So I would say between your title, description, and your thumbnail... That thumbnail might be way more important than you imagine because if it's not enticing, they're not going to click on it. If it is enticing, then you'll get the clicks. And if your title is right, then you'll get the right suggested video. And it takes some time for YouTube to get used to that. They also want you to 
your videos to be interesting enough so that the person watching stays to the end of the video instead of just clicking off and going away. So all activities to entice the YouTube user to stay on YouTube longer. And that is how uh, you would increase your viewership is by nailing this thing. And it might need some trial and error, test, experiment with a few different looks, colors, images, um, until you can see that pattern and it starts to build up. So definitely split test this part of your a video. I've actually, um, I had a video where I wasn't getting any views and I swapped out the uh, the thumbnail and it, the viewership started to go up a little bit. Not drastically, but it, it, it went from just a little bit to start getting some motivation, motivation, momentum and, and uh, additional traction. So definitely something to look out for. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching till the end. And as promised, my, uh, my offer and free gift to you is if you head on over to buildyourarmy.com slash custom, I will create a custom uh, business model for you based on your business, exclusive to you. And I prove that it's exclusive to you by using your name in the video. So I create a business model with a sales funnel and a website and email marketing uh, system and explain all the ways you can monetize that business idea that you have. So if you have a business idea and you're wanting to know uh, a few ways to, to monetize it, maybe some things you haven't thought of or stack different ideas on top of your existing business, get yourself over to buildyourarmy.com slash custom. It's completely free. And uh, I will send you that video similar to this breakdown. Again, thank you for watching. Keep building and enjoy your life.